Thinking freshly from experiencing is actually a different kind of process. Thinking about the established concepts uh, is a kind of thinking that we are most familiar with. But where did all these established concepts come from? They must have come from somewhere too. There must have been some thinking and some minds who created such concepts. So where did these people go? They must have taken some different route. I have to say, okay, you have all learned this other kind of thinking, which is only that you learn concepts and then you can repeat them. And the most that they ever expect from you is maybe you rearrange them a little bit. But that's not thinking. You are not thinking. Who is thinking? Well, the people who made up those concepts, they were thinking, right? These concepts that you teach and learn, they didn't drop from heaven, they didn't... Somebody thought that. The whole system is so made that they give you the impression that you can't do that. But in the book they tell you about some other person who's dead, and that person could think. And there, of course, they think. But they don't tell you about the thinking. They only tell you about the concepts that they make up. So you get the, the conclusion. How they do that they are not talking about. And this is my revolution. They go somewhere, and when they come back, they have new concepts, new ideas, new terms, new words. And you say, well, where did you go to do this? They tell you a story about where they got their new ideas. So then you don't get to go there. You get to hear about it, but you don't get to go there. Because to go there is not these concepts. So what is it? Well, it's thinking. But really thinking. So it turns out that if you know focusing, then you already know where they go. But at the end of all of that, to not be trapped in one of these, but to be able to use all of them or any of them, and to see what you can get from all of them or any of them, you need to stand again in your own experience, in your own felt ongoingness, which is this intricate complexity inside of, of life. And if you stand there, then you can use any and all of these strategies. It turns out that even if you don't know any of them, you can still do something from there. You can still formulate what you know that hasn't been said and can't be said in the public language. We don't have to have them for this one practice, this one purpose, this one capacity to put into the world what hasn't been said yet that you're carrying from your particular experience. Mm -hmm.